Hello and welcome to the next episode of my channel where I'll be taking up the poem Fire and Ice from class 10th. Now this poem is written by Robert Frost who is a nature poet and in this poem he talks about the symbolic meaning of fire and ice which would probably be the cause of the end of this earth. According to him, some say that the world will end in fire, whereas the others say that the world will end in ice. The literal meaning, fire means a volcano or something, and ice might mean an, a glacier melting or something, but in this poem, the metaphorical meaning of fire is greed, over ambition, lust of people. And ice stands for the jealousy and hatred which they have for others. So according to him, some people feel that the world will end because of the desires of some people, whereas it might end because of the jealousy which people have for others. But according to him, whatever he has known of desire, fire would be the cause of the end of the earth. But the poet also says that if the world had to end twice, then ice is also enough to be the cause of the end of the earth. Now, what are the metaphorical, uh, what are the, sorry, what are the poetic devices which are used in this poem? Some say alliteration. Some say the world and some say in ice because the consecutive lines begin with the same word. It is anaphora. From what I have tasted of desire, you cannot taste desire. So this is a metaphor. He is uh, comparing desire to a food item. And But if it had to perish twice, something cannot die twice. So it is a paradox. It's a self-contradictory sentence. So these are some of the poetic devices. You may find other alliterations as well. That is world will in ice. So these are other alliterations as well. So I hope you have understood. So in a nutshell, again, what does this poem mean? It's a metaphorical meaning where fire stands for greed and lust and desire to get power in life. Whereas ice stands for jealousy, which one person holds for another. So thank you and do like the video.